And you see, the interesting thing is that in the presence of God, one of the assignments of the Holy Spirit as touching the ministry of the word is to breathe upon your faculty. Listen, so that you are able to understand the truth that is communicated regardless your level of education, regardless your level of intellectual exposure. That means if you did not have the, the opportunity to be enlightened in terms of the way to broaden your faculty of understanding, you should not be punished because of that limitation. So the Holy Spirit grants something called utterance. Utterance is not oratory. Oratory is your own labor as a man of God to learn to use words to transfer thoughts effectively. And I've taught you that effective communication enhances the understanding of the people. But there is a spiritual quality given to men called utterance. The ability to make everyone see and understand what you are saying. It is utterance that is responsible for inventing the examples that suddenly come out of your spirit. It is utterance that is responsible for helping you communicate the truth. Sometimes it manifests as a song. Sometimes it manifests as a repetition of the points. Sometimes it manifests as an example that suddenly someone who may not be as literate just nods and said, I finally got it. That one is not creativity. It is utterance and it is a gift. And the assignment of that grace according to Ephesians 3 and verse 9 is to make all men see it can open the eyes of men so that they see and they understand. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Kingdom Voice Network, dispensing the gospel of the kingdom.